Whew. What's up guys and welcome to yet another part one here on the channel. It's been a little bit crazy lately, but we actually had three major games come out today. So I'm sure you guys know Far Cry New Dawn. I've also already uploaded Metro Exodus and uh, this is the third new game that came out today. This is Crackdown 3. So uh, it's an Xbox exclusive. I believe it was supposed to come out back in like 2016 or something, but it was delayed quite a few times and uh, I'm gonna be honest, this, like, I, I don't know much about it. Like, I, I haven't played any of the other Crackdowns, I don't know much about the series. I know it's kind of like an action adventure, like, you know, crazy spray and pray, just kind of like action game, you know what I mean? Like, it, it's not a super serious, heavy storyline or anything, there is a story there, but it's more about just, like, mindless fun and action, and uh, I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens here. Honestly, the other two games that came out today, Metro and uh, and Far Cry, those are, those are probably gonna be... Uh, full series. This one, I, I don't know if it's gonna be a full series. We'll have to wait and see what happens. <laughs> you guys can see we've got Terry Crews here, but yeah, it's something new. I haven't played it. I wanted to check it out, so we'll see what happens. New York, Moscow, Seoul. A whole new group of cities just got hit. It's chaos. And the intel we've got is shaky at best. These are dark days, Commander. Don't worry, sir. We're here to light shit up. <laughs> Good old Terry Crews, dude. I love him. Okay, this is kind of cool. I like the soundtrack. Gives a thumbs up <laughs> for <a> what? <laughs> what is happening? I'll take that as a yes. I'm I'm lost already. I <laughs> it, it would be nice if I I played the other two games. You got pretty cooked in the crash. Had some but I backstory. recovered some agency intel, combined it with my own. Here's what you need to know: the blackout attacks. Oh, 
hundreds of cities got hit. Power grids, communications, it all went down. Things got real bad real quick. People were desperate. They left their homes, their lives. Millions of refugees, all looking for a little light in the darkness. And I was one of them. Enakshi. Enakshi Swift. But most people call me Echo. We spent weeks on the water, low on food, hope. But then, Terra Nova rescued us and brought us here to New Providence, an island nation founded by Elizabeth Niemand, Terra Nova's CEO. At first, I thought this place was paradise. But the deeper I looked at Niemand and the rest of her team, they're not what they seem. And I bet you thought the same right before your team got shot out of the sky. Now, it's just you, me, and a city filled with survivors from the Blackout Zones. We can help them rise up, Agent. Rise up and knock Terra Nova down. Okay. So it's us and the people against Terra Nova. It's kind of like the, the synopsis I got there. Interesting. So yeah, this, I, I don't know, man, like, Games like this sometimes don't make good Let's Play games. They're more fun to play than to watch, if that makes sense. But there have been some that have been really good. Um, think of like Sunset Overdrive, if you guys remember that. Like that was a pretty fun game back in the day and stuff. I don't know, we'll, we'll see what happens. You guys let me know. I know the reviews on this have not been the greatest, but um, I'm always down to try something out. So we'll, we'll do, you know, this episode, maybe a couple more and We'll talk about it. We'll see what happens. If you guys are enjoying it, we'll continue it. If not, okay. we'll do something else. I'm not an expert with agency tech. I got the regen process working, but reset all your skills. I'll have to level back up. I just love that it's Terry Crews, dude. <laughs> this was the safest place okay. for me to rebuild you. But no place is really safe in New Providence. So I got you this, a welcome gift from the civilian militia. A pistol? Oh, All right. Oh, we've got a gun. Those glowing green orbs? There's some kind of agency training hologram. Grab them to boost your agility skill. Easy enough. Those are the bad guys up there Another in the skyscraper. Terranova rescue operation. They've been airlifting refugees for weeks. Welcome, citizens of the world. Welcome to New Problems. Terra Nova was born from a dream, a vision of brighter tomorrows, a vision powered by human potential. Together, we will forge a bold. We need to shut down the propaganda they're feeding the refugees and the force fields they used to contain them in the Outlands. Best way to do that? Take out the nearby power station. Okay. Press X to pick up and drop objects. Is this blue line kind of like our, our path that we're supposed to follow? I'll take a lock on objects and enemies. This is the place, Agent. Watch out for the guards. Yeah, these guys look bad. He's down. Woo! The auto aim is strong here, boys. Okay. How do we reload? Nice. Alright. Pick it up all kinds of agility orbs. Looks like we just gotta level up, okay. Where do we wanna go? Huh. Here. It looks like your suit just updated. I'm seeing new jump boosters, unlocked and active. Okay. That's pretty cool. We'll take it. Almost done. Oh, this? What? Oh, baby! <laughs> that was sick. Vita melee, okay. So we're getting blue, or blue orbs, I'm assuming, uh... Those are kind of like combat orbs. 
I'm gonna try going upstairs in this power Energy station here. Took a hit. It will recharge over time. See what happens. What but is this? But if you attack an enemy, looks like your shield will recharge even faster. Well, that's I nice. Guess the agency likes to reward aggressive action. Okay. We can deal with that. Uh... Tap Nova Communications. Spying on them for a change. I'm happy to report those guards didn't get a chance to call in. We're still off the radar. What is this thing here? Get ammo. Nice work. Yeah, dude, this is just kind of like, it, it takes everything, it's the, the auto-aim is crazy. It's just straight auto-aim. What do I do here? Hold to eject. Oh, okay. I think we're removing power from this this tower. Unbelievable! The agency is on the island? Give them a proper Terra Nova welcome. That ray of sunshine is Wilhelm Berg. All right, so we opened her up. Is this like a boss fight or something? Or are we gonna have to go take this dude out? Looks like he was loved at first. first if all goes well, he won't be our last. His official title is Manpower Lieutenant. A fancy term for bastard who preys on the helpless <laughs> and he gets away with it because he's got the keys to the city i marked your crime map with that power station you took down but berg has already tapped into a set of backup generators his main gateway is still locked down if we're going to get you and the refugees into the city we've got to take that backup station out okay well, now that terra nova knows you're here they'll be increasing their defenses stay alert let's place a waypoint and we're gonna head that that way we gotta gotta work through, kind of work our way up through the henchmen and stuff, and eventually we're gonna get to the head of Terra Nova. Got some cool rolls. You're coming up on an old Nova supply point. Get close, and I'll see if I can reactivate it for you. What's up, boys? All right, supply point is yours. Check it out. Looks like any weapons and equipment you find are automatically added to your inventory. You can access your inventory from supply point. Okay, well that's pretty cool. We don't really have anything extra right now. All right, you found a We're fragmentation grenade? Looks like pretty standard explosive fare. How do I throw it? Not bad. Let me throw this at somebody. Yes, sir. Get out of here. The guys up here. Not the most accurate attack we've ever had, but let's let's get closer. Get up, get up. What's up, bro? You're down. <laughs> Nothing I can grab onto. Ooh, another level up. Use RS to sub-target enemy body parts. If I'm reading this right, I think your eyes just evolved. Your aim. You've got pinpoint accuracy. Okay. I'm trying to get up top here. I think we gotta take, take down these generators up here. Okay, let's let's test this. Bro, this is dope. Okay. Use RS to Bro, that's dope. Just purposefully target their head. That's pretty cool. All right. Let's get rid of these things. Not bad. So that's the backup power station that's been disabled. We have 100% intel and we might. He's vulnerable. We're going to be able to take him down. Yeah, this is kind of like a boss. I've tapped into Berg's gateway systems. And he's vulnerable. Now we know where he is. All that's left is taking him out. All right. Let's do it, man. Let's go take him out. I feel like this one was easy enough. Granted, this is kind of like, I would say like a tutorial of sorts. Robot wardens. These machines are relentless. No pity, no remorse, no fear. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. 
I love being able to just automatically lock onto people's heads, dude. Plasma Looking rifle. Let's see what this is all about. Plasma rifle. It is straight up sci-fi weaponry, except it's real and in your hands. He's down. Not too bad. He's got some range now, finally. Ooh. Finish up here and get to the. I'm here going. Go. Berg is printing reinforcements. As long as he lives, they'll keep coming for you. He's printing reinforcements, so we we just gotta keep pushing. I don't even know if killing everybody is a good idea. Got him. Whew. What's up, buddy? Not for long. Belongs to Terranova, and the gate stays closed to Agency Azor. How'd he do that? Berg just teleported. Get after him, Agent. Thank you for this, Agent. Now you here, and I get to make an example of you in all the worst ways. Going for those headshots, baby. Training time. Hurting. I'm not even gonna focus Keep on his down. henchmen because I feel like they're just gonna reprint. You won't take me down. Keep focused. Hit him hard. Watch where he goes. Let's finish this! Okay. I hate the goddamn agency! Well, we're out of ammo in that, so that's gonna be a problem. Eat that grenade, bro. Okay. How about that one? Woo! Good night! <clears throat> Holy shit! I can't believe it. We got past the gatekeeper. And the people of the Outlands, we've helped them into the city. Microsoft Studios presents. I know we just met, Agent. But I've got to say, we make a damn good team. And we're just getting started. Okay. I don't know how I feel about it so far. I don't, I don't hate it. It's probably gonna get better. You're, you'll get more involved with the story and care about, care about the characters and stuff more. But it's also, it seems very, very basic. Hang on, someone stepping the line. Agent, is that you? Very easy to. Oh my God, we thought you were all dead. Oh, it's your boss, man. This is Agency Director Charles Goodwin. Who the hell am I talking to? You can call me Echo. Or even better, the person who put your agent back together after some shitty intel almost got them killed. Thank you very much. Stealing agency data is a criminal offense, Miss Swift. Hey, the only criminals I see are wearing Terra Nova suits. And with my help, your agent is already bringing them to justice. Listen up, civilian. The Agency is the world's preeminent crime-fighting task force. We've been kicking ass since before you were born. This time, it's different. When the blackouts hit, even we were blindsided. Then our satellites came back online and found the one major city still glowing in the dark. Five years Terra ago, Nova. this place was a desolate spit of land in the ocean. Yes. It's truly inspiring what a greedy, all-powerful corporation can accomplish. It all starts with Elizabeth Neiman, but she's recruited one hell of a team to build her dream. Dick Catala Vargas, head of the industry division. Vargas was a Nobel Prize-winning scientist, now in charge of Chimera, the stuff that blacked out the world and left so many of us lost in the darkness. Or how about Kulinagata, the hired muscle handling security? He is a butcher will do anything to protect company interests, especially if it means spilling other people's blood. Last but not least, Alois Quist, architect of Terra Nova Logistics, the control freak who designed this entire island and keeps it running like clockwork, at any cost. Terra Nova is using local monorail stations to direct the flow of human resources.
If the refugees end up on those monorail trains, God only knows what'll happen to them. Agent, you are in enemy territory with no shortage of viable targets and a clear-cut mission directive. Save the people, save the world. Take down Terra Nova by any means necessary. All right, sounds like we're headed to the subway here. Agent, now that I'm hooked back into your vitals, I see our friend regen you with a baseline set of skills. You'll need to rebuild yourself if we're going to save the world. Wouldn't all this be easier with a bit more agency assistance? Maybe we'll get lucky and find more survivors, but all other assets are overwhelmed in the blackout zones. So for the time being, you're on your own. Unless we start a revolution. If the locals want to help, great. But my agent is there for one reason, to stop the blackout attacks. Can we get... Um... We can travel and stuff. Can we get ammo from here? See, like if I come to this, no, you can only change your weapon. Or maybe it gave us some. I mean, we've got some now. We didn't have it before. Okay. Whoa, we've got cars. Can you drive them? Nice ride. And I'm sure the owner doesn't mind the agency borrowing it. I've scanned it to your inventory, so it's available anytime you need it. Just hit a vehicle capture pad around the city. Well, this is cool. I didn't know you could drive. This is like a futuristic GTA, but in third person and kind of looks like an Xbox 360 game. I mean, they, the graphics aren't bad, but like the, the what's it called? Watch the enemy fire. Wait, where's, how come we weren't shooting there? Not really an Xbox 360 game. I guess that's probably unfair to it. It does look decent. It, it's just the cartoony style. Like it's, it's not. It doesn't necessarily look like a next gen game, but then again, neither does Fortnite or something. You know what I mean? Not everything has to be perfect and really beautiful. Get ammo. There we go. That's what we needed. I'm not sure what this thing is. It's electric. Be advised, a threat is your area. Basic station defense protocols. That's pretty cool. Focus on the station master. Hold on. That station master is looking for a fight. Take him out. Got him. Woo! Greetings, Agency Operative. A polite reminder that your current course of action is in flagrant violation of Terra Nova law. I wondered when Roxy would come out to play. What is Roxy? Is that like the a monorail network on Siri New or something? Is run by Roxy. A friendly customer service AI, corrupted by Terra Nova. Oh. Every monorail station we take forces Roxy to adjust operations nearby, putting more of their network in our sights. So the more stations you capture, the closer we get to finding and offlining Roxy. Okay. 46% survival chance over there. 38% over here. I mean, I'm, I'm always down for a challenge. Hey, good news. While you were taking that monorail station, I heard from the militia. They reached the refugees before Terra Nova. Good. Then we can focus on dismantling the rest of the enemy's distribution network. But be ready, Agent. They won't make it easy. Hmm. So we just got a bunch of new skills and energy grips and all kinds of stuff like that, bro. There's so much happening in this game. You got a new energy grab. Um, dude, I don't even... Nova 
was activating the prisoner hardpoints. The locking of militia members. We need them back on the street, ready to mobilize. Okay. Free the militia, it says? Is this it right here? Yeah, let's go let's go do this. This one's a little bit closer. Bro, these cars are insane. Just totally ran into something, but that's okay. What's up, boys? Nice to meet you. Woo! Hit him with the nade right there. That was that was nice. Agent, pop that cage and get those people free. Where's everybody else at? Put a guy down here. Problem is, we have that lightning gun and we have this long range gun as well as the, the pistol. So our I pistols are only like short to medium range option. We could pick this thing up. Let's pick this up. Instead of our pistol. Not bad. I'm going to take some of this ammo. Hack into the mainframe here. Get these prisoners out. Yes. Those guys will regroup with the militia and be ready when we need them. Yeah, I feel like this is gonna be a lot of what it is. Which, if you're just like mindlessly hanging out, just shooting enemies, that sort of thing, that's Come that's on, pretty Jack. cool. Bro, look at this thing. But I don't know, like, as a let's play game, is this our best option? You know what I mean? Your stable grows. New vehicle added to your inventory. I'm gonna be honest, this thing is dope. I wanna have some races. I hope they have races in this, but uh, yeah, I don't know, it's just, it's it's all kind of a little bit of the same thing. Like obviously you progress the story and there's dialogue and whatever else, but it's just kind of like, go run, go shoot somebody, destroy a generator or free somebody, go run, go shoot somebody, destroy a generator or free somebody. It's all, it's all fairly similar. Um, we should be, there was another subway thing. This is that, that thing we had marked earlier. What happens if we... That is Monkey Moonshine's distribution center. Shipping poison to the people. All the more reason it's got to go. Oh! Robot loaders. Woo! They'll hit you with anything they can throw. Where y'all at? Eat this! Ah, oh, we missed him. That's not bad. I really don't like these guys. We got them though. So that's another nice. monorail station down. It's two Moon out of five. Shine distribution is shut off at the source. We're one step closer to saving the locals. So if we get five of those things, we're gonna be able to shut down Roxy. I don't know, man. This this is interesting. Um, I don't want to pass judgment too soon. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think so far. I feel like that, I mean, we're about 30 minutes in. It's kind of a decent first look at the game. Like I said, we're, we're probably going to do at least one to two more of these just to kind of get a feel for it, just so we kind of, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to I don't want to write it off too early, but I'm not sure if this is the perfect Let's Play game for us. I don't know. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Obviously, that's the most important thing. So, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Subscribe if you haven't already. Peace out.